happy Thursday. Uh, today is Thursday, it is eight o'clock, and I'm actually driving to the Hyatt at the DFW um, airport because um, Sally is having an all-day conference. So I get to spend time with my collab family, so I'm super excited. I haven't seen them in forever, almost a year. Um, so basically it's gonna be kind of a beauty conference where we meet a bunch of the Sally Beauty Associates, um, test out, tease, um, sample, critique, modify, perhaps new product launches. Um, and then, so that's gonna be almost like an all day thing. And then in the afternoon, around 6.30, we're doing a meetup here in Dallas. I feel so lucky that the Sally Beauty headquarters is in Dallas um, because I didn't have to travel. Um, and that's always like a super plus for me. I'm not a big, I'm not a big traveler. So I'm stuck in rush hour traffic for about an hour, which will be good because um, I should be there uh, 10 to 15 minutes early, if not just on time. Um, so it's cool, but I mean, even though there is no travel involved, it's Dallas, so no matter where you go, there's travel involved. <laughs> there's a few toll roads and a few, a couple highways that you have to take, so everything is a distance away. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to that. So it'll be a cool day, you know, playing with new product, um, seeing everyone from collab um our family uh just meeting all the associates that are going to be playing with our product um we do have a little um uh, fun video project that we're working on with leisha and then uh yeah a cool meetup in a really trendy part of town um, and then some dinner plans. So that's super exciting. I mean, you guys know I vlog Friday through Sunday usually when I vlog, um, but I just could not resist and bring you guys along. So brace yourselves. This video is probably gonna be two hours long. Last week's vlog was about an hour and a half, and that's what happens when I take a week off. I'll make up for it, you guys. It's pretty gross. <laughs> anyway, do you guys like my uh, nail polish? Kathleen Lights again, you guys. I love her polish, you guys. I don't like her brush, though. Oh, I can't get over it. Her brush, like, I like her polish so much that I struggle through using the brush. I have massive nail beds, like massive, and that brush is still too big for me. So I can't imagine someone with like little, little nail beds. Um, anyway, so yeah, we're gonna get stuck in uh, traffic. We're already stuck in traffic for about an hour, um, but you guys are gonna come along with my day. This week, uh, what do we have going on? So tomorrow's Friday. Uh, I do have to get a lot of work done. And then Saturday, oh, Saturday's super exciting. Saturday, I'm gonna be my friend Hilda's date for um, a concert, John Party. If you guys don't like country, you have no idea what I'm talking about. But uh, yeah, John Party, so that'll be cool. Uh, and that's it, it's gonna be a cool weekend. I'm finally feeling like myself, I feel a little bit better. I'm still a little because of the medication I'm taking. <laughs> um, but that's a, a medical expression for the record, in case you're wondering. <laughs> I feel like if I uh, feel sick, like if I act sick, if, I, if I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm so sick, I feel worse. So if I just kind of just brush it off, like brush it under the rug, it's not as bad. Um, so yeah, anyway, eight o'clock. I'll check in later. Bye guys.
you guys, it's 11 o'clock. I am currently at the Hyatt, but we are in between um, certain activities and I am not needed for like the next hour. So I have to find something to do for an hour. So we're just being like the creepy girl in the lobby taking selfies and Insta storying. But I wanted to show you guys how massive this like conference actually is. How cute is that? So down here is where the actual like Sally Beauty Summit is taking place. Um, so it's really, it's like a big deal here in the city. We're gonna meet a lot of the associates and the CEO. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. But for now, I guess we're just gonna go on an adventure for an hour and see what kind of trouble we can get into. I'm kind of starving. I didn't have breakfast, but I know that once this uh, activity is over, we're gonna have lunch. So I don't know if I should just wait. I do have some rice cakes in my bag. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, you guys like my shirt? Isn't it the cutest shirt ever? Let me show you. Like it's actually supposed to be like that. Isn't that adorable? It kind of looks like Hugh Hefner pajamas though. When I left the house, I was like, mm, do I love it or do I hate it? Anyway, so that's all we're doing right now. Are people looking at me? I don't think anyone's even like noticed that I'm like over here talking to myself. Which might be a good thing, right? It's lunch time! I like how I'm starting on the dessert side first. Yes. Can I have this plate of this whipped up? butter? <laughs> Hey, hey, you guys. So we are inside the showroom. This is where Sally Beauty is exhibiting all the brands. It's super, super exciting. We're gonna have our own booth. But for now, let me show you what we do have going on. Um, this is the candy booth. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Do you guys see what's happening over there? Look at that. Oh, snap. <laughs> Again, um, I don't know how I find myself in these situations, but that's what happens uh, when you live in a metroplex. So I'm actually on my way to meet you um, at Sally Beauty on Oak Lawn. So that should be super cool. I really hope I'm not late. Um, I am super excited. I actually changed. I didn't think I was going to. But then all the guys were like, oh, well, you know, I'm gonna wear this, and then I'm gonna wear a cocktail dress, and I'm gonna wear, you know, a cute little leather jacket. And I was like, I have no excuse to not change. I live here. I could basically wear all my clothes, like Joey on that episode. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, so I changed. I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. I'm actually wearing that shirt from my uh, Forever 21 haul. It's like my red dress emoji shirt. <laughs> and then I'm wearing like this bright, bright, super bright yellow skirt. I basically just flashed like my accelerator and decelerator pedals. <laughs> um, and then I'm wearing these shoes. <laughs> well, I'm not actually wearing them right now. I'm gonna put them on when I get out of the car. Um, but yeah, so that's all we're doing right now is we're driving to the meetup. It should be so cool and um, I'm excited to see you guys. Um, hopefully um, there's more than like four people, but even if there's one, I'll be super excited because that's me. <laughs> anyway, um, I'll bring you guys along like I have been all day. I love you. You guys, I just got to the meetup. Do you want to say hi to everybody? We're outside Sally Beauties in Oak Lawn. I'm wearing like the worst shoes possible. You guys say hi! Hi, hi everybody! Hi. Am I late? No! no. Early. I can't wait to see you guys! I just got here and she's the first one in line, so I was like, we have a special connection. She needs to be in my vlog. What's your name? Amethyst. Am oh, Amethyst. <laughs> my goodness. Wow, I like that name. Thank you. It made me nervous. Like my mom. Yeah. Oh, wow. 
cool. Are you guys like have you fun? Like, what, are you gonna shop? Yes. Have yes. you tried it yet? We've been kinda talking did. to each other the whole time, so it's like kind of. So you're all friends now. Yeah. 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 Oh, you guys are gonna be in the vlog. You guys are gonna be in next weekend's vlog. Yeah. This is my new friend. And she wants to be in my vlog. Just kidding. I totally finagled her into my vlog. Are you excited to be here? Very much, yes. Did you watch the party? Yes, the liquid, the um, sparklers, the eyeshadow. Oh, the liquid illuminizer? Yes. Oh, yeah, really nice. Cute. You like it? Yes. Yeah. You're really pretty. Thank you. So you guys, I met a tall friend. If this ever happens, I don't have to do this. I mean, I can. I can, but you'll look really short. So, you're a vlogger? A vlogger? Yes. yes. Leslie Types uh, is my Instagram and my Twitter, but I write the blog Pop Goes the City. Oh, you should leave a comment in this vlog and then we'll pin it so people can go to your vlog. Okay, you sounds do that? good. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> So, you guys, I have never seen this in person. Check this out. Oh my goodness! <gasps> wow, this is surreal. Who are these good looking peeps? Who are these good looking peeps? Oh my goodness! You guys, so I met two very special girls being here at our meetup. The first one is by the name of Miss Hannah. the Sally Beauty Oakland meetup. What an experience. Um, I don't even need to talk about it. You know, you guys saw, I, it was just, anytime I meet you guys in person, it's such, it's an experience I can't even describe. I actually came home, um, everyone else went to dinner at Woolworth, which is a really nice and fun restaurant in Dallas. But um, I told you guys in the last vlog that I haven't been feeling well and I have to take some uh, medications like at a specific time in the day and like right after I take them, you know, within like 30 minutes and stuff, I start to feel kind of yucky. And uh, the Woolworth is not that close to my house. So I was like, oh, it's not really, I just, I just need to take care of myself, you know? And I was conflicted because I love hanging out with these guys. Like they are such, <sighs> they feel like family. You know, and seeing them and being in the same city is just such a great experience. And they just, I just, I, I wish I could explain to you the feeling, you know, they're just all heart and they're just, it's such a special team. Um, anyway, so I uh, got home and everyone else is going to dinner, but I don't know if you guys know this about me. There's a few things in this world that like literally make me lose my mind. Like I am obsessed with them. Like Jordan almonds is one of them. Lemon meringue pie, steak, no. <laughs> There's like very specific things. One of those things is, are you ready for this? I don't think you're ready for this. Banana nut muffins. Oh, you guys. If I could have a banana nut muffin boyfriend, like my life would be complete. Banana nut muffins, 
are my life but they have to be those like sticky moist ones moist i hate that word moist but moist um kroger kroger has the best banana nut muffins so I'm going to eat this with a giant glass of milk and then I'm going to go wash my face and put on a sheet mask because this makeup has been on my face since 5 in the morning. <sighs> my poor face, you guys. Anyway, so I'm going to eat this and then we're going to go take off our makeup and then um, I guess I'll show you guys what sheet mask I use. How about that? Let's do that. Let's do that. You guys, it's officially midnight. What the heck have I done with my day, with my life? <laughs> Um, so we're gonna sheet mask. Can we talk about my face? It is super broken out. It's so bizarre. I'm not using anything new. Um, I just, I've been wearing makeup for like 19 hours. It's crazy. Do you see that? You probably can't see it. Maybe if I turn sideways. It's like three dimensional. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys. Let me take you to my secret stash. So this is like my sheet mask collection and I have them organized by brightening, um, moisturizing or hydrating, anti-aging, and then back here, back here is exfoliating, bubble masks, um, anything that's like more aggressive, I guess you can say. But with sheet masks, I just like them for brightening and hydration purposes, so I mainly stay in this section here. Um, so I beat up my face today. It was... It's a pretty, pretty long, um, long, long, long day, and uh, I want to use I want to use something to treat my face. So, what is this? Tones and moisturizes. Look at how cute that is. It's like a rainbow mask. Um, what do I want to do to my face? Let's see. Beauty secret. I think this is anti-aging. Yeah, smooth and firm. What about this? Diminishes fine lines and signs of aging. Yeah, these are all anti-aging. So we need to stay kind of in this area. But I can't find my decadence mask. Like when I don't want to think, I just go for the decadence. I think it's here. Hydrate and vitalize. I need that. What about this one here? Stay gorgeous. Hydration and nourish. I think I'm going to use this. Um, this is the BioBell Stay Gorgeous Mask. It's for hydration and nourishment, and I feel like after wearing makeup for so long, that's kind of what we need to do right now with their Tencel Fiber, which is made with um, wood from a sustainable forest. So it's kind of a really, um, it's kind of like a go-to mask. When you don't even want to think about it, you're like, yeah, I could use a little hydration. Boom, you apply that to your uh, face leave it on uh, one of you guys asked me if you put it on for longer than the time it says on there I always leave it on for longer um, So yeah, we'll go ahead and try this one. Okay with this lighting you could see what I was talking about Isn't that random like I never get breakouts ever and on my forehead It's like unheard of it almost feels like a mosquito bite. <laughs> so I'm gonna go in with the stay gorgeous This is a hydration and nourishing um mask it is paraben free and it has no gmos look at that do you see the serum it's like generous serum apply that on the double chin <laughs> you guys know um hydrogel masks are my favorites they feel like um they feel like a special treat for the skin it's like an extra um, it just feels like a second skin but on days where i really abuse my face there's nothing like an actual cotton sheet mask to just feel like it's soaking in the product. You know, like the hydrogel masks feel like a nice treat, but these cotton ones just go on so nicely because they're so wet. So you really feel like you're pampering your skin. Like you feel the serum really soaking in. So tomorrow when I wake up, I'm not gonna look like I had a 19 hour long day. I might look like a teenager with that breakout, but hey. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this on for 20, 25 minutes. I'm kind of tired, so I do wanna go to bed. So I'll leave it on for at least 15 and let that soak in so that tomorrow we look nice and fresh and not tired. Okay, see you guys in 15. All right guys, the moment of truth. Ugh. That moment when you like peel it off is like the best moment ever. Um, 
whenever it's a mask that you doesn't, why am I whispering? Like if someone else is in my house, whenever it's a mask that doesn't require rinsing, I just kind of gently pat it in like all the excess, bring it down to my neck. And I just kind of let it air dry for a little while. You know, if I really want to go to bed and I know I'm just going to pass out, I'll take like a, a towel or a paper towel and just kind of bump off the excess. I think I'm just gonna let that serum hang out. My poor face, you see that? She's angry. She is angry. Anyway, you guys, today was, <sighs> today was an amazing day. And uh, I'm excited for tomorrow. And uh, this vlog is probably gonna be like three hours long, but that's okay. Uh, I guess it's already tomorrow. It's already Friday. Happy Friday, you guys. <laughs> Oh, if you guys are wondering or if you forgot, this is the mask I use. It's the Stay Gorgeous from BioBell. Yeah, so I'm going to head to bed um, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed today. The beginning of the vlog because do you guys see that action um yesterday was such a great day um it's actually eight o'clock right now i woke up at seven but i was just replying to email and doing stuff like that upstairs um so right now i was like wait what time is it um i haven't had my coffee so yeah it's eight o'clock um i am going to go back upstairs clean my beauty room a little bit because it's kind of a disaster put some laundry away um, and then take a shower and film um, because I want to just crank out a ton of videos this weekend. So I'm going to do that. But anyway, so that's it, you guys. Um, today's Friday. Um, I'm going to go to the movies later today. But other than that, I don't think I have anything else to do besides work. Um, and then tomorrow, Saturday, I'm going to go to the John Party concert with my friend Hilda. So that should be fun. Anyway, but for now, that's it. I'm going to do my coffee, laundry, and... Uh, clean my office. All right, you guys, it's 11 o'clock. I just finished uh, cleaning my entire studio. I put away a ton of laundry. I did a couple more loads. Look at this romantic lighting. Um, and then I just made myself breakfast at 11 o'clock. We'll just call it brunch. So I just did chorizo, um, which is like a Mexican, like a really, um, uh, it's more like a condiment because chorizo in Spain is like an actual sausage that you can slice, cut, dice, you know, but the Mexican chorizo, um, kind of like melts into the pan and just seasons your, whatever you're doing, eggs, or if you're putting it in like sopas or tacos or something, um, it turns into like a really, really fine, 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 uh, flavorful, like ground product. So I did chorizo con huevos. And then I have a little bucket of blueberries and that's my little tortilla thing. <laughs> so I'm going to eat this and then I'll go take a shower um, and start getting ready um, and then film a few videos today. Hey, hey, you guys, it is 4.30. I just finished filming this uh, Get Ready With Me. Um, not my proudest look. I was feeling a little creative, but it didn't necessarily turn out the way I wanted it to. I don't hate it. I just don't love it. I'm actually using um, a few colors from the Just Peachy Mattes from the Too Faced, the new Too Faced palette. I love this palette, by the way. I think I might review it for you guys in English and Spanish. Um, but the majority of the eyeshadows are from the ColourPop My Little Pony palette. Um, still don't know how I feel about this. I like it, but I don't like it. You know what I'm saying? It's cute, but it's like meh. And then on the center of my lid, or like rather on top of the lid, I'm wearing one of these color shock shadows, which is why it looks like glimmery and sparkly. Anyway, so yeah, I just finished filming this Get Ready With Me. I'm gonna film one more video. I think I'm gonna film this advent calendar that I got from Skin Store, which is kind of exciting. It's one of those like really cool Christmas presents that you can give before Christmas. I'm kind of one of those people. Like I want to know that you liked it before Christmas. <laughs> That's going to be a giveaway video. So I will link it in the description box below if it's live yet. Um, 
But for now, I think that's it. So 4.30, I did my makeup. I'm gonna change. I'm definitely gonna change. Um, I'm gonna film that other video and then we'll see what we do for the rest of the afternoon. Hey, hey you guys, it's six o'clock. I just changed. Um, I was only able to do one video, um, but I got last minute invite, so I'm heading out. It is six o'clock. I think I already said that. My brain is foggy, but I wanted to show you guys uh, my outfit of the day. I'm actually not very proud of it. In fact, I'm not sure I even like it, but I don't want to change. I kind of wanted to wear black jeans and I'm conflicted because outside it's super windy, but it's warm. And I kind of wanted to wear black pants and like a really light, light, lightweight sweater. Should I change? I mean, it's not like we set a time to meet, so it's not like I'm gonna be late. Anyway, this is a shirt from Forever 21. I haven't actually worn it. I love it, for the record. And then these jeans from STS Blue, and then some little coach flats. I really like these shoes. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I feel like it's kind of just frumpy dumps. Kind of want to change, but I also don't want to be hot. And last I heard, we were gonna see a movie, and then I'm always cold at the movie theater. I'm conflicted. What should I do? Is it hot outside? Let's check the weather. I think it's hot. Anyway, whatever. Maybe I'll change. If I change, I'll let you know what I wear. If I don't, then I'll see you later. <laughs> Happy Saturday, you guys! Where has my day gone? It is 4.30. 4.30. So I stayed up very late having one of those deep, emotional conversations with someone until like 3.00. Um, and then I woke up at seven and then I went back to sleep and I didn't wake up until, wait for it, 12.30. Never in the history of my adulthood do I think I have, do I think, do I know that I've done that? You know what I'm saying? So actually I just uh, curled my hair. I have like four pounds of hairspray in it. Please don't look at the inhabitant on my face. Honestly, I don't know if it's a bug bite or what it is because it is gnarly. I don't get blemishes like these, so I don't know how to function. Like it, all I look at is the blemish, you know, or whatever it is, spider bite. I don't, honestly, I have no idea. I feel like that guy on Austin Powers, like mole, you know? <laughs> so um, yeah, I took a shower. I curled my hair, put three pounds of hairspray in it. I'm gonna put my makeup on right now, um, get dressed, and then I have to go to the mall and get a gift and then I'll probably just go straight to my friend Hilda's house. We're gonna go to the John Party concert at um, Billy Bob's in Fort Worth, so I'm really looking forward to that. Let me show you guys what I'm gonna wear. So I got this dress at American Eagle the other day. I thought it was kinda cute. Um, it's a cold shoulder dress. I don't wanna wear a strapless though, so I might like let my bra straps show. It's at nighttime anyway, you know? Um, so it has these cute little cutouts. Obviously I'll put it on later for you guys. Um, well, not for you guys, cochinos. Um, I think it was on sale. I don't remember paying $50 for it. But it's from American Eagle. It's a little mini black dress. Um, and then, see it's the cold shoulder kind of halter situation. Um, and then for shoes, um, I don't know if I should wear my boots, like my everyday, like regular casual cowboy boots that you guys have seen me wear before. <gasps> I'm not wearing toenail polish. How weird is that? I feel naked. Or these. Aren't these adorable? Look at that. These are Sam Edelman's, so they have like that cowboy-esque flair, but they're still really like cute and girly and feminine. And I actually have never worn them. So I'm looking forward to that. Hopefully they're not painful, but I don't know. I think I might wear the tall boots because the dress is so short and you guys know how I am. I'm like, oh, you know, I don't want to be naked. You know, like I'm so modest. <laughs> so my dress is super short. So I might wear like the taller boots just so my like my legs aren't hanging out. Um, yeah, so that's the plan. Right now I'm gonna put on my makeup and then we'll run a few errands and then probably just go straight to Hilda's place. So I don't have to like be going back and forth. Um, I never even told you guys what I did last night. Like I never checked in, I never did anything. So um, I told you, oh, I think the last place we left off was like I wanted to change my outfit. I didn't change my outfit and I left and then a friend of mine and I just went to see a movie. We saw American Made. So one with Tom Cruise where he works for the CIA. He's like, a, he works with the cartels and stuff like that. Uh, it was all right, I, I don't know, I just, I wouldn't watch it again. <laughs> um, and then yeah, and then I came home. I got home like at maybe 10. 
Um, but yeah, that like conversation that I'm telling you guys, maybe you'll hear about it in the future, um, was kind of draining. I actually have a really bad headache today. And I don't know if it's because of my meds or because I'm dehydrated or I could very well just be tired. But yeah, I have a really bad headache. And so I was doing the whole um, ibuprofen, um, acetophenamine. Fun fact about Danny, I don't know how to say Tylenol. <laughs> I can't say acetophenamine and so many people have tried to teach me and we do the whole syllable thing and it's just it's not happening uh, Anyway makeup catch you later. Hey, hey you guys it is six o'clock. Uh, I'm pretty much ready to go I do have to run some errands, so I'm not gonna bring my camera along But I wanted to show you guys my makeup and my outfit of the day. Um, I'm wearing the um just Peachy Matte's palette from Too Faced, which for the record, you need. Um, this unicorn nose might offend some of you. <laughs> it's kind of offending me right now. <laughs> um, but I kind of like it. Then I'm wearing Seduced at Sea from the Alluring Aquatics Collection MAC a long time ago. My lips are two products from, from Collab. It's a lip liner and a lip gloss. I'll have to I'll have to go check and tell you guys. I think the lip liner is called In the Flesh and then just a nude lip gloss on top. And then my dress, it's the dress I showed you guys from American Eagle. So it's just like a cute little floral dress. It's kind of wide. I mean, see what I'm talking about? Like it's a small too. I was like, do I look pregnant? Should I wear a belt? <laughs> um, so it's from American Eagle. Um, it has the cold shoulder. It's a halter. Do you see how the straps are kind of peeking? Whatever. And then I'm just wearing those boots um, from Cheyenne that you know, my neutral cowboy boots that I wear for everything. You guys should totally follow me on Instagram. Um, I'll be posting on my Insta story um, from the concert, so that should be fun. I hope you guys like country. What's this with seductive lighting, you guys? <laughs> so uh, yeah, it should be a very, very fun evening. Um, I'm excited to bring you guys along. Maybe I'll take some video with my phone, you know, like normal people. <laughs>
Monday. It is 10 o'clock. Um, I just got out of the shower. I think, I'm not sure, I have to confirm. I think I'm gonna go to brunch with a friend of mine. Um, and then after, I'm just gonna come home and film a few videos, edit tomorrow's video, because uh, I don't have anything. <laughs> Oops. Um, and then um, go to church at seven, like the like the evening one. I love going to the evening one. So last night's concert was so much fun. I went with my friend Hilda and a few of her friends from out of town. Um, and then my friend Hilda is she's so much fun and she's such a great friend. She's like one of those girls that I could call at like three in the morning and she'll show up and be like, all right, let's hug it out, you know? <laughs> um, and so it was so much fun. She's not a big country fan, but like I told you guys in a previous vlog, like you could throw Hilda in any scenario, whether it's a charity event or like, um, I don't know, a NASCAR race or a country concert or uh, any anything, like any sort of situation and she's gonna have fun and she's gonna make the best of it and she's gonna make friends. Uh, she's just one of those very awesome, amazing like women that you wanna have in your corner all the time. So the concert was amazing. I realized how much I enjoy going to concerts and I think that's gonna be one of my like propositions or uh, goals for 2018 is just to go to as many concerts as, as I can. Um, I just have so much fun. Um, yeah, so the concert was great. Uh, I actually didn't get home until like 1.30 um, because the concert ended at 11.30, but we had to Uber from Billy Bob's to downtown where my friend lives, and then I had to drive from downtown home. Um, and it was just, the weather was horrendous. We were like on tornado watch. It was raining really hard. It was raining so hard where like the wipers don't actually function because by the time they swipe, it's already covered in water. So it took me like twice as long to get home. Thankfully, I didn't drink, um, so it wasn't, I didn't have like componing factors that were gonna, you know, um, affect my ability to not die. <laughs> so, do you guys like my shirt? I love that it's colder weather now. Like, fall and winter clothes is my jam. Like, I love, I love to be covered up. I feel like I look better. Um, no, I just love flannel. I love like over the knee boots, riding boots. Um, like really thick tights and tunics and stuff like that. I just love layering. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna get ready. Um, blow dry my hair, put on some makeup. I don't wanna do anything crazy today. So I'll put on some makeup and then uh, bring you along with my day. I really hope this vlog isn't like 72 hours long. I had a lot of complaints in last week's vlog because it was an hour and a half, but I don't know, I just can't. I can't cut it down, you guys. I can't stop this. It just keeps going. <laughs> Holy paleness, Batman. This is what happens when I uh, don't use bronzer. <laughs> this is my normal, um, who's that? This is my normal complexion <laughs> when I'm covered up and you don't see my tan. So I'd like to introduce you guys to this new look. It's actually called Lumberjack Glam. <laughs> so here's my outfit of the day. Um, we have a nice navy blue flannel um, and this quilted vest. And wait, the piece de resistance. We got some Tims. <laughs> I told you, I like fall, but I don't know if fall likes me very much, but I don't know, I feel, I feel comfortable. It's cute, right? No, not even a little. I kind of like it. Anyway, it's 11 o'clock. I'm heading out the door to go have brunch and then I'll probably run a few errands after and then come home and work. Yay! You guys, seven o'clock. I don't know what's going on with this romantic lighting. It's not even dark out yet, but I guess my camera wants to be super sexy with you guys. Um, I have been out all day. I left my house at 11 o'clock. Um, I went to Starwood for breakfast, or lunch, I guess, at that point. Um, and then after that, we just ran a bunch of errands. You know, we went to Nordstrom Rack. I didn't even know there was a Nordstrom Rack in Frisco, which was a super exciting discovery. Um, we went to the Rack, we went to um, Off Fifth, I think it's called, like the Saxon Avenue. Nordstrom Rack. <laughs> um, we went to Academy Sports. Uh, what else did we do? We went to the dog park. It was just one of those days where it was like, okay, let's keep hanging out because we're having so much fun. See what I mean? Like, it's not even dark out. You see what I'm saying? What kind of mind f was that? <laughs> so, um, I'm actually 
immediately on my way to church. I got home like at 6.30 and I was like, okay, I have a list of stuff that I need to tackle. You know, I have to like film a video and edit it and put it up for tomorrow because I don't have anything ready to go. So I'm gonna do this. And then I sat down on my desk and I was trying to figure out my calendar with like videos that I wanna do versus videos that uh, I need to do that are like contracts or whatever, deliverables they're called. Um, and so I started to like play with dates and numbers and move stuff around and then I look up and it's 6.50. And I was like, girl, you need to haul your booty to church. So that's what we're doing. And on my way out, I had my little envelope, you know, like your, I don't even know what that's called in English. It's like the envelope that you, like your weekly offering or whatever. And uh, I forgot it. So now I have to like fill it in with my hand, which I always get nervous about because I'm like, are they actually tracking it if I use these, you know? Anyway, so yeah, heading to church and then uh, I'm gonna go home and work. But that's it for this weekend, you guys. Um, it's been a busy weekend. I'm very excited. Um, I'm actually going to church in a very good mood. Um, I am in one of those mental states where I'm going to church because I'm so thankful as opposed to I'm so worried or I'm so nervous or I'm so scared or I want to ask for something. You know, I'm, I'm in this, in this very like, man, I just want to go because I'm so thankful. You know, things are, things are working out. Things are looking up. Things are awesome. So yeah, I'm driving over there in like the best mood ever. I might be like two minutes late, but you know what? At least I'm there. Uh, but yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, Thursday was really exciting, wasn't it? There goes the sexual lighting again. Um, Thursday was super exciting. Um, I'm not quite sure how long this vlog is gonna be, but uh, hopefully you guys will tune in for all of it. When you guys are watching this vlog, I would have already posted a video um, of an advent calendar. That video is actually a giveaway. So if you guys are interested in getting a really cool advent calendar, I think it's worth like 400 bucks. Um, I will leave a link to that video in the description box below because I know sometimes like you miss videos or they don't come out on your feed or whatever and I hate for you guys to miss out on it so yeah you guys that wraps up this weekend I really hope you guys enjoyed it like always all of the stuff that I'm wearing using mention cooking with uh, whatever will be listed in the description box below and if I can link it it'll also be linked thank you guys for your constant love and support and always uh, being a part of my life you guys left me really cool and very useful comments in last week's vlog so that was really exciting for me but uh oh my god el que mucho se despide right anyway you guys that's it for this vlog i love you so much and you know what to do if you found this video useful entertaining and learned something please give me a thumbs up sexual lighting and subscribe if you haven't already and until next time this coffee break is over i love you guys